Welcome back to Greg Pixel and today we are making a lights like this effect for this video so let's get into it. So first of all just make a canvas that is 1920 and 1080p and make sure to change the background color to black. So I will just create it. Now click on this type tool and choose a font called Akira. The link will be in the description. So I'm gonna change the font color to white and I'll just click anywhere on my canvas. And I'm going to type light for this. Now I will press Ctrl J on my keyboard that will duplicate this text layer and I'm gonna put it below the light text. So just change this text to slice and I will just resize it. Now hold Ctrl on your keyboard and just click on this light. So it will select both of these text layers and now just click on this group icon so it will make a group of this text now hit ctrl j again and that will duplicate this group as you can see we have group 1 and group 2 so click on this group 1 and i'm gonna unite this and go to fx and choose blending options set the fill to 0% and click on this stroke and change the stroke color to a purple i'm gonna set the value to 3 and press ok once you're done now unhide this group 2 and click on it now click on this new layer icon and take a brush now you have to choose a hard round brush and set the hardness to 0% and increase its size like that Ar around 1000 works fine now change the foreground color to a purple and just tap once now press ctrl t on your keyboard and hold alt and just make it something like this actually i'm gonna reduce it more like that So I think this is fine. Now press Ctrl and T on your keyboard and just rotate it like this. And I'm gonna place it here. Now hit Ctrl J on your keyboard. Take razor tool and remove these edges. Make sure to use a soft round brush for this one with 0% hardness on it. Now hit Ctrl J on your keyboard that will copy this light effect and place it right here. Now hold Ctrl and select both of these light effects. Right click on it and select merge layers. Now click on this group and take this polygon lasso tool and make a selection like this one. Hold shift on your keyboard and make a selection here as well now press ctrl shift i on your keyboard that will inverse this selection and now just click on this add layer mask icon now if you want to add edges to your white text so we're gonna do that so just take polygon lasso tool and make random edges like these make sure to hold shift Make sure to hold shift every time you make a selection like that and just go crazy with this. So I think this is fine. Take this brush tool and make sure you have black foreground color and just paint over it. That was it for the video. If you like to see more videos like this, make sure to subscribe and see you in the next one.